Hey friends, it's me Laura again from Kind of Fun Gaming and today we're gonna take a look at the top 10 Nettie's games for Android. So without further ado, let's get started. Starting with number 10, it's The Ride Out Heroes, the first multi-class battle royale game for mobile. You can choose from mage, hunter, engineer, assassin, and warrior. Each class has a unique combination of weapons. Glide around a magical 3D world with beautiful green forests and enjoy an amazing visual experience. Moving on to number 9, it's Super Mecha Champions. Unleash your Mecha and fight for the crown you deserve. Select from an all-star lineup of robots and join the fierce clash with your skills. Amazing graphics, manga-style cities, man versus man, Mecha versus Mecha, all new exciting combat experience. Moving on to number 8, it's Theseus. This game takes clear inspiration of Cyberpunk 2077, where players play the role of a bounty hunter who does all the bad stuff just for money. The game world set in early 2063, where all humans have evolved into advanced civilization and some of them are cyborg. You have to earn money by completing the in-game missions. Moving on to number 7, it's Cyber Hunter Light. This is the light version of the official Cyber Hunter game. You will get almost the same experience of the main game in less size, all power-ups, all weapons, all abilities, but in low graphics. Moving on to number 6, it's a clap style. This is the first anime style hero battle royal game that features unique gaming experience. This time you will fight with not only the guns but also arrows, shield and swords. Moving on to number 5, it's Disorder. This is a hero-based battle royal game set in the year 2030. All heroes have their unique abilities. You can play as a sniper or you can also choose medic and heal or revive your friends. Moving on to number 4, it's Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. This is a 2D side-scrolling action RPG game, Metroidvania-style gameplay. You play as Miriam, an orphan, scared by an alchemist's curse that slowly crystallizes her body. You need to battle through a demon-infested castle and defeat its master to save yourself and all of humanity. Game has more than 107 weapons and skills with over 120 minions and boss fights. Moving on to number 3, it's Identity 5, another hide-and-seek horror and survival game. It's an asymmetrical horror game that brings gothic art style, mysterious storylines, and exciting 1 vs 4 gameplay. You can say it's a cute looking version of Dead by Daylight. Moving on to number 2, it's Cyber Hunter. This is a next generation competitive sandbox mobile game. You can glide in the sky, dive into a deep sea, climb and roll. There are lots of parkour moves available to use during fast paced free combat. Game rules, the last man standing. Finally to number one, it's Creative Destruction. This is also a sandbox survival game that features the utmost fun of building and firing. This game is very similar to Fortnite and also allows you to play, to play in FPP mode. Bonus game! Racing Master Racing Master is the newest Unreal Engine 4 racing game for mobiles developed by NetTease. In this game you can experience intense racing with precision engineered vehicles and access hundreds of sports cars including Ferrari, Ford Mustang, Lamborghini and many more. Also, the game features lots of customizable options which seems pretty cool. And the game has triple A quality graphics and you can play it with your friends. Well, that's it for today guys. But if you want to see more videos like this one, then why don't you subscribe and turn all notifications on. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I will meet you in the next one. Bye-bye!